Are you looking for the best gaming monitor under $100? In this video, we will break down the top gaming monitors under $100 on the market. Before we get started with our video detailing the best gaming monitors under $100, we have included links in the description for each product mentioned, so make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Starting off at number 1, we have the Acer VG220Q. The Acer Nitro VG220Q is part of a very affordable range from Acer that will definitely not break the bank. This zero-frame gaming monitor boasts an IPS display in full HD with a seriously quick response time of just one millisecond. This is an entry-level monitor, so for its price, you won't tend to find monitors with all the bells and whistles on it, but you can find the odd bargain that could be perfectly suited to your needs. The monitor's IPS display means you don't have to worry about viewing angles, and you could use this without issues for entertainment, but do bear in mind the color accuracy isn't as good as more expensive options. So if that is an important factor, you may want to adjust your budget slightly. There is little to no movement from the stand on this monitor, but it does give you a front-to-back tilt, which is enough to get a good position, and you can't ask for more at this price point. The design as a whole is quite nice, with the zero-frame feature, which is basically just a thin bezel edge. From the picture, the red stand doesn't look the most appealing, but out of the box, it works and looks brilliant on the desk. This monitor may be slightly over budget, but you are getting a high amount of useful gaming features at a very reasonable price. The full HD IPS display for this price could be enough to entice a lot of gamers, but it also features an incredibly low 1 millisecond response time and free sync, making this near perfect for gamers in the under $100 price range. At number 2, we have the AOC G2260 VWQ6. Like the 22-inch Acer Nitro monitor, the AOC G2260 VWQ6 falls in the same price bracket and shares a similar set of features. This monitor comes just under the desired $100 budget and is a reliable bit of kit for something this cheap. This would be considered an entry-level monitor, which boasts a response time of just one millisecond. The monitor does feature a TN panel type, so the viewing angle may be limited on this monitor, but for gaming when you're going to be sitting directly in front of the display, it shouldn't be an issue. An IPS gaming monitor with a decent enough response time would normally be priced slightly higher than this category, so for those on a budget, a TN panel may be the way to go. The monitor comes with free sync out of the box, and when paired with a 75Hz refresh rate, it makes for some really smooth, tear-free gaming experiences. The design is fairly straightforward and boring, with no real points to discuss, but it comes with a stand, and there is a small amount of red on the bottom bezel. What's great about this little monitor is that you can take the stand off and mount it to a Visa-compatible bracket if you desire. This monitor may lack those key features that some gamers are after, but it ticks the boxes and does it on a budget. That being said, you are getting enough useful gaming features at a very reasonable price, with anti-blue light and flicker-free technology, making this near perfect for gamers in the under $100 price range. At number 3, we have the Acer SB220Q. The Acer SB220Q may be the cheapest recommendation we make for monitors, but it's by no means a slouch. This monitor not only comes way under budget, but it sports an IPS display with a reasonable response time of 4 milliseconds, which is a good middle ground for a lot of gamers. This low-profile monitor sits at just under $90 and looks and feels like a very nice display. The IPS panel may not be the best, but in this price category, it's a welcome feature to have and it does a fantastic job for gaming. Response times sometimes suffer from this panel type, as we see here, but anything under 5 milliseconds should still be considered as it's very hard to notice. It is worth noting, if this had a quicker response time, then it would probably be higher in the list. You are getting FreeSync technology with this monitor too, which should be a bare minimum, even in budget monitors these days. The monitor's refresh rate is also capable of 75Hz, which when you game with FreeSync on, eliminates input lag and stuttering issues you may face. So the features of this monitor aren't too bad, but the main thing to talk about here is the ultra-thin profile to this. From the side, it's nearly invisible. The ultra-thin display is great, and the thin bezel edges only adds to the sleek design, making this one of the more attractive monitors in the under $100 price bracket. Unfortunately, this isn't compatible with Visa, so you're limited in that regard. Overall, for a budget monitor, it has to be taken seriously, and thanks to a good amount of features, this monitor can please a variety of gamers across the board. At number 4, we have the ViewSonic VX252MH. The next budget-busting monitor in our video is this 22-inch from ViewSonic. As standard, you will be getting ViewSonic's Game Mode feature, which can enhance colors such as darks while in-game. Along with this, you get a fast enough response time of 2 milliseconds, but it's a bit disappointing this isn't 1 millisecond, considering the fact it's a TN panel, but 1 extra millisecond isn't noticeable. 
It is worth noting with this range of monitors, if you have an extra $30, you can afford to grab the 24-inch versions for those that require a large display for gaming or television. This monitor may not have the same features as some of the others, but ViewSonic produces a lot of gaming monitors, and it's a brand that you can trust. Despite the lack of features, it does have a good enough response time to consider this for competitive gaming, and the display is actually quite crisp. The monitor may not have the best panel type or feature FreeSync, but it does have built-in speakers and can be used as a multimedia monitor if needed. Although the speakers in these sized or priced monitors are never that good, this still has to be considered. And for our final pick at number 5, we have the Scepter E248W. Last, but by no means least, is the Scepter E248W and its 24-inch display. Here, it is shown again that you can tick a few feature boxes for the under $100 budget, with the monitor boasting an ultra-thin large display and design. The response time could be quicker, seeing as it's a budget TN panel, but it's also not so slow you'd notice all that much anyway. It is worth noting that these Scepter displays are quite popular budget monitors, and their range does vary in price, leading to some bargains for those who hunt for a good deal. You can even pick up the smaller 22-inch version for under $80, making it one of the best for value available at this size. This doesn't feature FreeSync or a lightning-fast response time, but it does provide a nice display to enjoy games in full HD. It uses a TN panel, which unfortunately isn't as bright as your IPS panels, but it still does a brilliant job. The design is stylish and the overall look of the monitor is brilliant. It features really thin bezel edges all the way around the screen, and it has a very thin profile too, which means this monitor wouldn't look out of place in even the most advanced setups. This budget pick is for those on a budget looking to get a slightly bigger screen. If you are after anything more than that, it may be worth checking what's available in the under $150 price bracket, but all things considered, this is still a solid monitor for the price. So that sums up our top gaming monitors under $100 of 2020. We hope you enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like on the video, and if you're new here, hit that subscribe button. Until next time, have a great day.